could send those away from there too. And if I could copy this setting and put this in here, paste that. Okay. Oh, mate. Wrong spot to do it in. Play that much. Is Are they down? Uh, you're not downed yet. You will be. I'll tell you that much. You're definitely going to be. Let me save that because I, I don't want to redo all the shit that I just did. Hopefully they don't die. Because sometimes it can be so quick, like, it'll load out of this and I have... Oh, silverware. No. No, 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 no. Go back. Go out of there. I'll tell you what, they are going to need critical care now for some reason. I uh, just get that feeling, you know, sometimes. <laughs> yeah, can you just pick them up, please? You lot, if you can just stop doing that. Go back to what you're doing. All right, everybody else is mostly okay. Um, grasshopper mate. Hey, Shadow, how you doing? Um, reminds me. Oh, um, Rin is going to fucking Netherlands soon. <laughs> we were having a conversation earlier, and I'm like, I don't know if Shadow be salty or just like be like whatever. So the fact that uh, he's going to Netherlands, and I know you wanted to, but yeah. I don't know, this is just what we were talking about earlier. I don't have much time for today, but wanted to jump in for a while. Nice. Well, it's good to hear from you. I'm not streaming tomorrow night, so, and seven days isn't releasing until like 3 a.m. my time, so. Netherlands. No, 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 Netherlands. Uh, Rin's gonna travel to Netherlands uh, this summer. I know you wanted to for work and stuff, and there was a whole complex thing about how you kind of can't and stuff. But um, I was going to say at least at least one of my people are getting there this summer, I guess. It's, I don't know. It's sort of like a semi-positive thing, maybe not. I don't know. Um, but yeah. Look, I finally got 242 people. And I'm going on a attack quest soon. And... I might take a, I might take 16 more people. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake, you lot. Mm, Netherlands, Norway. Netherlands, as far as I know. Where are you, grasshopper mate? Aren't you a prisoner? Yeah, you are. You are probably just going to take it out on somebody in here. If I could bring in somebody to just take you down. Can we just stop you from doing that? Yeah, as far as I know, they're going to Netherlands. I don't know... I personally do not know the separation of Netherlands and Norway. I'm not that worldly, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, I imagine it's all kinds of separate area. Do not kill. Do not kill them. Come on, everybody get in here. Just stop them, stop them, stop them, stop them. Fucking do something. Are you fucking kidding me? Do not hang back. Get in there and... and thank you. Jesus. Fucking Christ. That was nearly gonna just allow that shit to happen. This is so hot and quite far away from Norway. Okay. Yeah, no, I just... I would need to pull up a world map for me to know, unfortunately. It's just one of those things I just didn't uh, learn geography and stuff and haven't had much of a reason to beyond conversations with you guys to sort of learn the world. Um, but yeah, I was curious how the fuck you doing, man. I don't think Subway's gonna attack... I don't think they're going to catch up to Skizza, honestly. And Skizza's got a death wish by doing this because they've got no medical care. If they go down, they're just going to get stripped and that's it. Okay, cool. You're very lucky, Skizza. Like, we've taken them down a few times and they haven't died. So they've got to be real lucky at this point. Where's the far north Netherlands is middle of the continent, kind of between Germany and France? Yeah, see, I still need a map for that. <laughs> um, like, I know shit in Australia. I sort of roughly know where uh, Singapore and um, New Zealand is and stuff like that. But that's about the extent of it. Anything else, I require an actual map to be able to be like, I don't know where the fuck shit is. But um, I was curious if uh, Satisfactory has done its update <clears throat> yet or not for you like if you've got to start on that yet I assume you're still on like medical 
leave and whatnot. I think we took out Grasshopper, it's not a problem. And then you set your way down under, so it's not like it's useful knowledge to you anyway. It's more so because like I never plan to travel. So for me it's it's irrelevant space in my brain. That's how I kind of like view this kind of thing. Hold on, I need water. If I was somebody that planned to travel, I would probably look more into where places are and like what's going on there and stuff because I don't. It's not something I tend to feel like I need active information on generally. That's just generally why I don't look up stuff because I'm like it feels like it's taking up space that I don't really need for anything. Like if I, oh shit, that's really bad. If I was, um, if I planned to travel to somewhere, I'd be like, yeah, I'd look up all sorts of stuff about it. I'm actually still sitting up straight. I got posture checked earlier tonight and I'm still going good with that. But I will drink more water. I've kind of already had at least one situation where my voice is kind of gone. And it's kind of doing that now. I don't really know why. Like, it feels like it sounds restricted but I, I'm not in any pain or anything so I don't know what's wrong with it um, it's just kind of like I don't know failing to communicate in a way I don't know um, but yeah I've almost got all my caravans here shadow I've got nearly my entire colony it's here so far and the cool thing is all my load times and stuff are faster since I got rid of Quillen which is nice. I know that you guys want to break that door, but I get you work on the wall first. Yeah, work on that one too. All right, that way when the door goes, it's not such a problem. Uh, and I have these couple of doors to go to because I put them in the wrong spot and then I continue to build the wall. But yeah, I think what I was going to do with this is I was going to install them sideways like this. It doesn't make that much of a difference, but I reckon it will over time. And I can only move like a couple at a time. So what I want to do, because I reckon it'd be like that kind of thing. I, yeah, I was going to do it maybe from like down here so they'd walk through the center. But that would only really be practical if I made the door sort of centered. I could still do that. I could still make the door very much centered to this thing. Wouldn't really matter. And I also want to slap a couple of doors around here to close this off from outside. Although that's going to heat up this place. So what I could do is actually do doors there. And that might be better. That'd be a bit smarter, honestly. Won't make it as huge of a place, but it will do stuff. I reconnected with Ella, my friend from China. She convinced me to start playing catch games. Uh, are you good with gacha games or is it like a slippery slope kind of thing? It's like I used to have a couple of gacha novels that I quite enjoyed reading and stuff. But um, like I'm one of those people where I don't really like spending money. So it was never too much of a concern for me. Like I never had to really worry about uh, like stuff like that. Like I would just deal with whatever my character had more so than like... Um, buying things. This is my first time, but I don't get addicted to anything. That's good. Yeah, no, I um, I don't so much like get too addicted to like purchasing stuff like pay to win kind of behavior or whatever. But I definitely find that like if there's something that's really nice in a set that I'd like to customize, I'm more inclined to get it if I'm playing a gacha to begin with. I might be able to, I love how somebody's cooking with eggs here. I need to get lights in here too, but yeah, if I end up moving that down, instead of having that closed off door thing, I could have them centered since I'm not having it sealed to the outside. Cause that'd be too hot with the where I put the air conditioners. So I can only put the doors on the inside. It's gonna actually be different than what I previously had designed. Now that I think about it, I spent at most $10 in game shit in my whole life. <laughs> That's pretty good. I can't say the same. I played Pokemon Go for a while, so I definitely can't fucking speak much of like having restraint in that way. Um, Cause yeah, 
there's just times when I was walking around and I'm like, I can't be fucked not being able to like get this or do that. Like I've got so many hours in a day to play this game. I want to be able to like enjoy playing it and stuff. As for the doors, the middle won't be roofed right, so the door placement could be either way as long as you don't close. Oh no, this is gonna be this is gonna be enclosed. It's gonna be the rec room in here. So basically what I'm gonna have is this is going to be like a massive ass rec room. This will be food storage in here. And this is going to be like um, kitchen cooking and um, butchering area and stuff. I don't know if I want that swapped, but it doesn't really matter too much realistically. Um, so the only reason why I want to have a door here is because the way I put the air conditioning, previously I never had this as like um storage kind of area so i was able to close it off from the outer part which made this even larger because i was able to put um heated and stuff in the space in these corridors but i can't do that with this but it still makes it a slightly different design like i could make this like little section here unroofed if i wanted to and that would accentuate the little gap that I've got here which I might end up doing um but yeah once I've got the doors it should stop animals from being in here except for like cats and stuff cats and panthers um your daytime nighttime hold on bye Cole I didn't allocate you right hold on I don't care if they do fire starting spree I just need to make sure where are you this happens occasionally and whenever I get a night timer in the daytime, I need to fix it up as soon as I can see it. Um, that's one of the easiest ways. I'm normally a little bit better with this, with knowing that they're daytime is night times. So but I had two people. I had Baikal and Pigeon at the same time. And I don't think Pigeon's a problem for this. They were normal. Normal daytimer. But yeah. Once I get this whole area up here enclosed, I'll be able to put recreational stuff in here. Which will be great. And then I'll have... <coughs> I have a little hospital down in here as well. That'll be one of the first of the two hospitals that I'll have. I'm actually thinking about making four. I had four last time and that would involve putting it like here and here but that's only if I need that. They're still kind of pretty centered. Realistically I could put them like out here or something. I'll make first and you've been in prison so fucking much. Uh, let's see who I've got in here to work with. I'm reaching 36 degrees Celsius in spring. Uh, let's make you not shoot and attack McPherson. See how this goes. Um, I think maybe forced to involve more ther thermal control. Um, wait, are we? Oh yeah. No, I hadn't even noticed that. Is McPherson down? Yes. I eventually will get... I don't know where you lot are going. Oh, it's a separate prison. Yeah, no, that makes sense. I forgot I divided it just before. No, 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 that makes all the sense. Hold on. Let's get you fixed up with McPherson. Packs, mate. Just fucking pick them up. Um, so... We pretty much came from, like, a permanent summer location. So I haven't kind of, like... Everybody's shitty. Because basically, there's, no, don't shoot them either. There's a whole bunch of people that have traveled for a long time that have just arrived. There's a whole bunch of people that do not have bedrooms. Um, we don't have a lot of food right now because I just don't have food production enough for this group. Ida, not shooting. Um, we've had constant prison outbreaks, so I haven't really had the ability to actually get the prison like set up and nice for them uh bedrooms and stuff i haven't even really like done anything with that we put beds down we made rooms and that's about as far as we've got hamster you're in here too that's probably bad timing um sure speed up hamster i think that that one um ida or actually pex can you capture that one so yeah, this has kind of been the constant for the last couple of weeks. I've been, oh, no, you're already down. Don't don't keep killing them. This is kind of how it's been for a little bit. So I haven't had like we've only just got electricity 
we've only just got the barracks in a way that they're not going to kill us or result in me killing too many prisoners. Um, I'm still moving batteries around. I still haven't got a hospital. Yeah, <laughs> there's a lot. There's a lot to do because we've literally just basically got here for the most part. Like, I've still got people coming in. They reckon they're like a day away, but this is a couple of days per square on these. So it's, it's still like a week for them before they get here. So I'm mostly trying to deal with whatever the fuck is happening. Like, we've got a couple of grow areas. The animals are getting to it. I've only just planted this one. Um, and it's not growing that fast. I also need to enclose these eventually when winter happens. If I have electricity enough by then, I'll do it. Um, but I really haven't at this point. And I've got to work on this area for bedrooms and shit, unfortunately. Let's get rid of these two. Get those out of there, because these are going to be another bedroom. So yeah, I haven't really had a chance to kind of like work on basically any of that stuff. My colony. Getting an enclosed area to keep the animals in somewhere. Getting the prison in order. Uh, getting bedrooms started. Like this has been the priority order so far. Getting some level of food is great. Like I need to enclose this area down here so we can have like a third enclosed like this is also an attack area too i've got to open that it's ancient danger but i can enclose this for the moment and that way i can have a pen i don't actually know quite where i want the doors to be for this how did i do it with the other one i put it on like the very far ends all right it's fine i put it on like here but i do need to move this up so we'll just put the one door on this for the moment because I need to also move these bottom and top area bedrooms up so we've got more bedrooms as well. But if I can make some of these into bedrooms at the moment, like this, I also need to sort out the doors. I think it's like every middle bit. I'm mostly just, I don't know if I want that on both sides actually. Maybe. We'll see. Um... Yeah, pretty much just trying to get it that everybody has some kind of shelter so they can stop fucking tantruming. Um, trying to get food. Like, I have a lot of everybody now, but almost everybody is on some kind of medical situation. So I can't do jack shit with them. Um, everybody's constantly going berserk or slaughtering or prison breaking or whatever. So I'm not getting very far with that either. Oops, I misplaced where that one is. It's fine, we can work with it. And I'll have to kick them out of their beds down here too, as well. That needs to go. Um, Alright. I might do. As long as nothing distracts me here, I'll do the lines across. <laughs> I had it last time where I left one of these because I didn't see it. It was kind of funny. Because it got all the way to fully constructed before I noticed it. Which is kind of fair if it takes that long. But, um, there we go. Uh, I can't put a wall there. Why? Or maybe I just couldn't put a wall there. Alright. And let's get rid of all these. This will have a roof over it too. This will be the next kind of, like, bedding area. Alright. Save that. I'm not building it again. I have two caravans going out to this attack quest. Which is also up against, technically, my ally. Um, that's pissed off at the moment because I can't make them my friends yet. Benico. Next up. Bad spot to do it in. Nobody's got a gun, right? No. Oh, you do. You two do. Hold on. Let's stop you from doing that. Stop you from doing something stupid like you. I've got to do something stupid with that. Okay, I think that's everybody that had a gun. I just saved right before this, so I don't really have to worry too much. Jesus! Who? You two, stop. Holy crap. Don't shoot. Uh, Dela Cruz did not need to be shot. Let's be honest there. That did not need to happen that way. Alright, you, Val, can you rescue her? Alright, let's get you out of here. God damn. You gotta be so fucking careful sometimes. Brick, mate, can you move that out of here? Right the uh, hauling. Bubba, why are you laughing? 
You're laughing because uh, what's his name got shot. Hold up. Let's get you lot out of that situation. We are all recruited. There we go. Okay. Who had a birthday? Ricklet. I think, I think it's just Ray. Uh, what did you get? I forgot to read it. Cataracts. Brilliant. It's not what we need. It's fine. Hello. How you doing, Bubba? How's your morning going? Oh, mine has been... Actually, this looks really good. Mine has been prison breaks. That's what mine has been. I also want to get some decent beds in here too. I also want proper hospital beds because I had to ditch so many. It's going to use a lot of my steel, but I've got a lot. Let's make it with steel. I want to have basically this entire place filled with these on one side. Only because I will maneuver them around. Whichever ones, like the good quality ones and stuff, I'll keep. Right. Uh, let's check up here as well. Let's get rid of these. These can go. And that can go. I also don't want them getting refueled anymore. Preferably. And I'll start making proper wooden beds. But I don't think it really matters what they're made out of. I could make them out of jade. I don't know if I've got enough of that. Hold on. I got 97 jade. I don't have enough of that. Uh, are you making an actual proper bedroom? Yes, so this is supposed to be my prison room, right? And my prison area is supposed to have legitimate, good quality, um, what you call it, medical hospital beds, legitimate, proper hospital floorings. Um, like, yeah. Really, Fred? Really? Mate. No. <laughs> I'm just, no. Let's take that back. I'm not dealing with that. So bed, uh, bed floor room. So at the moment, they're all sleeping on the floor, right? This was a storage crafting animal storage people sleeping hospital room. I had to vacate all that at like a moment's notice to bring in my prisoners and stuff. Who was that? I, I got up them. I'll have to keep an eye on that. I didn't realize they were destroying my fucking room. But, uh, yeah, I'll keep an eye on that. Um, yeah, basically, I am trying to make this a solid, like, area to fix this up, too. I got some flooring in here that's not supposed to. I'll just keep an eye on this door, because holy shit. So, this room's been, like, done over, like, three or four times, and I've had to, like, really just whatever at the last minute to get it to be a prison area because I have too many prisoners um, and I'm trying to get it to a point where I have got you know hospital beds and I have got um, like art and all sorts of stuff in here um, it's gonna take a while to get there but eventually I will um, yeah just taken a lot because this has been like the lowest priority type of things was just get a room let them be able to lay somewhere like that's been enough for a long time I've also had like shitty little outdoor spots to store stuff like this I don't want this um, I also do not want this to be a room that's functional I don't want that to be there at all but it is um, so yeah I'm working on that like I also have to go through these beds and stuff soon and just check uh, which ones are normal. Basically anything that's below excellent will get destroyed. Uh, hence the to roam away. Why? Why is there a part of this thing open? Probably where I am making the door down here. Yeah. There. Alright. Um, Linda, can you construct at all? Oh, for fuck's sake, I won't click on you. Fine. I'll find somebody else. That's how I feel about that. Not sure if you fix the door placement when you're working on the bedrooms. I... no idea. I, I have no clue. I'm kind of like going between several different things at the moment, so it's kind of difficult to know which one I'm successfully working on. Also, this being right here is going to make that a nightmare to fix up. Um, like, 
this we literally have on either side for the center ones we have on one side for those and we have the down bits for them to like get in and out and that's good enough the beds in this section i need to go they can all go and the beds that i'm making up here if i've got enough and they're good quality i'll send them down if they're not good quality i'll get them destroyed um i think most of them are good yeah and oh, one room is sorry that's fine. We'll figure it out. When somebody gets stuck in there, that one, right? When somebody gets stuck in here, they'll they'll figure it out. Um, let's see. I want all the beds brought down here. Basically, as many as I can, and then I'll start rebuilding them and stuff. I think you're not allocated. Getting this door built is going to be a fucking nightmare because of this thing right here. I don't want to cancel forming it. What I want is I want that gone from there. What I want is the next animal caravan areas. I want them inside of here, realistically. I don't mind if I have a couple of them, but it'd be fine. Um, yeah, no, I legitimately shout out. I have so much going on that, like, if something's out of place and you can see it, don't worry about it. I'll either find it or I'll figure it out. Like, I still haven't killed the thrombos that's come to visit. Like, that's the thing that's going on. I need these guys to move. I know Emmy's bringing down a whole clusterfuck of this, but can we instead... I guess you won't work on that. What I need is somebody with a gun to, like, spook them. Realistically. Um, do one of you two have a gun? You do. Can I get you up here for a second? Actually, fuck it. Come from this direction. This will do it. Come over here. And what I want you to do is I want you to fire at the mare. So that's going to get you guys all the way out of this. No, 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 kangaroo, stay, stay here. All right. Because once they're spooked, here we go. Yeah, I don't, I don't think you need to keep firing that specific horse. Once they're spooked, they should get the fuck out of this doorway. I don't know why this one came down here, but whatever works for it, I guess. Uh, where'd you go? Uh, did you just run off? No, 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 mate, get your ass back here. I'm not done with you. I just wanted you to stop shooting. Actually, you can fire too. Can you fire at the yak? Oh, no, I killed one, like, just about an hour ago. Yeah, get out of there. Get away from the door. You can fire at... Fuck it, fire at the yak. No, get it away from the door. Okay, we good? No, no, you fire at that thing. Get away from here. Okay, cool. Can you just hang 10 here? That one, that's fine. Now work on the... This is what we've had problems with. I don't... I legit don't care that they're going on the thing. I just need them to stay the fuck out of the door for just long enough. Don't do it. Oh my fucking god. I'll kill all of yous. Yep. This is the problem that I've had, is the animals will not fucking get out of the doorway. Actually, mate, just walk over it just a little bit. Okay, teaching soon, see ya. No worries, Shadow. It's good to catch up. Hopefully I'll catch you again another day. Uh, yeah, there's a dead calf. Let's keep, mate. No, no, no. I need you to fire at these so that they get the hell out of the thing. I'm able to jump in for a sec. Yeah, I'm glad that it was probably like a Rimworld day too, because, like, I don't know if you always get to catch them. Uh, nobody on that side. Spoonie. Yeah. Spoonie, can you take out Nick? I don't even know if you can attack Nick. Hold on. <laughs> you can't do jack shit. All right, that's great. Um, let's grab a couple of people from this end of the building. Yeah, I don't know. Sometimes I'm just like, I don't know, playing random ass games so I don't get to like catch up with you or you don't get to see stuff. I can't do anything about Nick here. For some reason, Spoonie can't do jack shit, but Ray can. Ray fucking can. Okay, get up in there. Absolutely just decimate Nick. Okay, everybody else is coming in here. Do not kill whoever you're planning to kill. I think one person should be enough. There we go. Alright. Get out of the area, Spoonie mate. Since you couldn't do anything before, can you capture Nick? Get out of here. Go, scout. Go. Alright, get out of here too. Alright. 
I don't know if they're okay. They're mostly fine. All right, now how is this construction going? Okay, we have nothing currently in the doorway. How about you keep working on it? There is a thrombo coming through, of course. No, no, no. Work on it. Animals are starting to go to sleep. Don't you fucking dare. No, no, no. Don't you tend to it. Fire at it. It's going for it. Stop. Stop. Good. Alright, now you can go back to whatever you're doing. Door is built. Okay. Door's built. This is the only problem I've got is animals do not give a fuck about the doors. If there's a doorway open, they will run from the other 